the most amazing artists. I am so excited to share with you our first official art project of the year. We are going to be learning about the artist that you see right here. His name is Andy Goldsworthy. Andy Goldsworthy is an artist who's known for creating art with objects found in nature. So we're going to be inspired by the artist Andy Goldsworthy to create a nature installation. An installation just means you're putting your art up somewhere where people can see it and it's kind of a part of your surroundings or your environment. So we're making a nature installation with natural found objects, which just means objects that you find in nature. So let's learn a little bit more about Andy Goldsworthy. He is a British artist that creates temporary art in nature. That means that his art is made out of natural objects that he finds and then assembles to create a picture or shape. His art is temporary because he leaves it outside and eventually the weather and the wind and water and rain and things will blow it away or knock it over. But that's okay. He photographs his art so that he can capture the beauty of it when he creates it, even though it is temporary. So for our project, our Andy Goldsworthy inspired project, I want you to watch this video of me creating my own Andy Goldsworthy inspired art. And this is just inspiration for you to get an idea of how this could look in your own backyard, but you do not have to do it exactly the way that I do. So here is the video of me creating my nature um, art. And after you watch that, I want you to go create your own. So you'll head outside, collect some natural objects such as leaves, acorns, pine cones, sticks, stones, anything that is found in nature. Once you're, you've found your objects, choose a spot and arrange them in a variety of ways until you find the arrangement that you like best as an artist. So you can make it into a circle or a wavy line or a straight line or into any kind of shape that you would like. Experiment with using different colors or you could experiment with using a lot of the same colors. Last, be sure to take a picture and share your natural art installation on your class's Seesaw page. I can't wait to see what you guys create. See you later.